Well, good day, YouTubers, friends, and family from across the world. This is Mike with Morning Dew Daily Events Worldwide. We are on October 25th, 2018. Welcome to another surviving day on this planet. Welcome to another video from Morning Dew Daily Events Worldwide. We're looking at the sun over the last 48 hours as that large filament eruption from the bottom left there is huge. Now, I was recording this last night. It hadn't quite ripped away yet but I did catch it again this morning and I'll show you exactly what that filament did because it did rip away with extreme force watch this so that is a large filament eruption earth facing so expect a geomagnetic storm, increased seismicity over the next 36 hours. Just showing you the sun under a different light here. Large coronal hole building as well. I want to thank all, my, all of my new subscribers for joining Morning Dew. Much love to you all, and please share this with your friends and family from across the world so we can all stay a prayer, stay aware and prepared. Just looking at the spiral from the cosmic energy. And the little yellow dot is our planet, Earth. And all of that green is the cosmic energy heading our way. Just wanted to get a close up here. Watch the solar winds around Earth. After that large wave comes through. A little bit of a backdraft. Pretty cool stuff, but please stay aware and prepared because we do have a geomagnetic storm heading our way. And then we're gonna look at the last 24 hours for earthquakes from around the world. We had a pretty busy 24 hours. A lot of 4.0s ringing off. South America, right from the South Chile rise or West Chile rise straight up to Colombia. And this is a forecasted region where I expect a larger earthquake over the next 24 hours. Very deep earthquake here, 4.7 south of Fiji, 526 kilometer depth. So with very deep earthquakes, oftentimes afterwards, you expect larger shallow earthquakes. This is the last seven days for earthquakes from around the world. There have been numerous deep earthquakes the last seven days, and not just in the regular Fiji region. This is everywhere, the Caribbean, Japan, Alaska, Indonesia. A lot of deeper earthquakes this week all around the world. And we're going to look at Super Typhoon U2, who is still a Category 5, heading west-northwest towards Taiwan now. It is done with Guam and the North Mariana Islands, packing winds of 145 miles an hour. Here's your five-day forecast, brought to you by Meteor Earth and Meteor Mike, showing a forecast here. Heading northwest, dipping a little bit west, but still on its way to Taiwan. So Taiwan, look out. Super Typhoon U2 is on its way to you. Watching large low pressure centers in the Pacific Ocean. Kind of an anomaly here. 
a large low pressure system I've been following for weeks now as low pressure systems have been joining forces in the Alaskan Peninsula. And you can see here, finally, that large low lets off enough energy and is able to make it over the mountains. But watch for colder temperatures to follow behind that once it gets through. Looking here at BC in Alaska, tons of snow will be falling over the next few days. Especially parts of Alaska where they could see upwards of two meters of snow in the mountains. And over North America, watching an Alberta clipper join post-tropical storm Willa to form a pretty nasty nor'easter bringing mixed precipitation to the Atlantic provinces and snow on the backside. Watch for colder temperatures to start invading North America in the coming week. I want to thank you all for watching today. This has been Mike with Morning Dew, daily events worldwide. Stay aware and prepared. Stay young and have fun and get your morning dew. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye. If you enjoyed today's video, please hit that like button, subscribe, share with your friends and family from across the world. Thank you.